Still not. Uh, there's always something still goes wrong. Even when you saw each the stuff that we just found out. Oh, come up, let go of the mouse game. Just let go of the mouse. Yeah, this is an old game, and it does not want to let go of my mouse. So, yeah, it's interfering with OBS somehow. It's not letting me use my usual store shortcuts. So yeah, that's why you <laughs> you suddenly had. This in the background of the intro. Okay, let's see. Come on, game capture. Any fools? <sighs> and no, we're not going. We're not leaving this game already. Come, come on. Come on, OBS. <sighs> Set the cap. Oh wait, is it? No, that. Why is it not capturing the game? It's not capturing it anymore. No, it's just showing the background screen that I have in place of a black screen. Yes. In twenty seconds. Come the fuck on! Is this... Mm. Yeah, awesome start to the stream, huh? Of course, with one of my favorite games ever. And OBS sites did not fucking work. Let go of the mouse game. I do not get why it just doesn't want to release it from time to time. Come. Uh, not that. Come on, capture specific window, giants.exe. It, it should. <sighs> Come the fuck on, game. I can't have this, this full screen on then. Uh, Rakio can't co commentate. Uh... The game has to play those, right? Uh, yeah. But a lot of it is also just the sounds and such. <sighs> yeah, I I don't get why some of these games just absolutely fucking refuse to let go of the mouse. I've, yeah, of course they're not designed to work with two screens, but you think someone would have figured something out with that already? And beyond that, I don't get why the. F OBS doesn't fucking yeah see it. It's it's literally in their capture specific screen, giants.exe, and it de still doesn't recognize it. <sighs> yeah, might yeah. I guess we might if this continues on, we might have to continue on to work must guide two immediately because the game just doesn't want to fucking work. Where the game works, but OBS doesn't want to work. And yes, this is more pissing me off. Uh, I can understand you. <sighs> Come on. Capture Pacific. Capture Giant. You are on. Do I have to move you to the top? No, you're still not working. Nope, it just doesn't want to work. Okay. Let's try this this way then. Remove yeah. that. I really Apply. hope it works for. I was planning to buy Ultimo Style 2 this weekend. Okay, will you find it with full applic screen application game or OBS? No, it does not. Okay, thanks OBS, you're proving to be an absolute piece of shit. 
So I guess we should change the name from this. Uh, let's watch Hillian's uh, rant at a probe that suddenly doesn't want to work. Like we've we've streamed a, like a dozen games with this already, or perhaps well more than that. And now it just doesn't want to work. Yeah, haven't you streamed games that were older than Yanyan of Kabuto? Yeah, it, we have. Maybe do we have to run it through DXWND or something for it to work? Is it not? I don't think it. Wait, I don't think this game is older than. Uh, <clears throat> I don't think this game is older than uh, Blood Omen 2, or maybe yeah, it, it's a 2000 game. Yeah, so remember, did you have a site to go to for this kind of problem? Yeah. Perhaps I have some info how to be able to stream it. Uh, yes, there's probably people thinking you should have checked this stuff out earlier. But as I said, OBS has worked with everything generally well, only with the really old stuff that it didn't. Yeah, uh, we have, there has been some games we have some struggles with, but we were at least able to fix it uh, decently quickly. But yeah, this time it's very different from those. Extra stubborn. Frame rate cap is on. Hmm. VR support, so be okay. Let's see, onboard, no, remove censorship, no. Uh, let's see, unofficial patch that adds several graphic up additional effects. Okay, might as well look at that. Where's the download? I see. Here is the download. I think if you put up a patch, you put in a fucking download link and not just what else has been changed. Come on. Okay, there it is. Uh, turn that off. And if, come on, a 10 minute down. No. Ugh. Well, absolute shit start to this stream. Yeah. This is a rough start. Okay, at least it's saying that. At least it's dropping its download time a lot, but still freaking minutes. But I, I don't get why the fuck it doesn't recognize it. Every other game it has at least found it, but in this specific game it just doesn't want to find it. But maybe there's something in the, the game's programming that makes the OBS blind to it. It, it it's not blind to it. It sees it. Window giants.exe. Hmm. Yeah, I, I, no. Okay, big lesson. Day before something is streamed, test if OBS will even see it, or will want to see it. Because this, this is just playing the first time this this has shown up. Yeah. Again, we have some issues with some audience before. But this one is uh... okay. Let's actually let's try a different route then, because I have this in here as well as a sort of backup. Mm -hmm. So let's see, nothing that should be private up there. Uh, display two, and then we open up the game. 
And okay, that captures it. Okay, screw the 5.1, uh, 1.5 mispatch for now then. Move this down. There we go. Okay, I should still be able to screen share it to you. Okay, I, I knew there was a reason why I kept that on. Now, let's see, nothing seems to be missing. Only the sound right at the moment, but that's because it's going through the intro. Okay, there we go, like 10 minutes late. <laughs> Uh, and sound. Well, that'll also mean, of course, 10 extra minutes to play, and, well, people get to enjoy the background of this. So, finally then, with probably everyone already gone, hello everyone who may be watching now later on YouTube, hitting here along with... Jackie! And welcome to, even though it was an absolute pain in the ass just then, one of my favorite games ever, Giant Citizen Kabuto. And I'm not even sure if that Citizen Kabuto is supposed to be a subtitle of sorts, but oh well. But uh, yeah, this is an old game. Yeah, actually, it's 21 years old now, because it came out in 2000, if my memory serves me right. Yeah, that's old! And yeah, it is where I got the footage from my, my intros, yeah, from my intro, my outro, and my general uh, avatar online from. Did something switch there? Either way. Uh, yeah, let's let's talk more game. Let's see, a boy called Timmy, help the helpless little smarty boy, hurry, he's in danger, go, shoot, kill all the rippers guarding him. Use the map if you need to finding him, if you need help finding him, beware unfriendly indigenous creatures, that's why you've got a handgun. Yeah, and as people can see, this game, even though it looks gold, personally I'd say, it still looks great. Because of just yeah. all the color work. Yeah, and it looks not bad actually, for... Uh... Yeah, I'd say for being too fun to understand the game, it looks quite good for being from that era. Okay, one little thing that I'm noticing now is that Baz takes a bit of work. Yeah, ba Baz or Basil. He takes a bit of moving of the mouse to get turning at first, but then he starts turning a lot faster. Let's hmm. have a little look on that. Neck control. Let's up that a bit. We're never inverting that. Okay. Uh, yeah, we have our basic hand pistol with infinite ammunition in it. And over here, we have baby rippers. Uh, yeah, these are our melee only enemy. Little bastards. They are generally harmless though, as they, well, they go down in two shots, but the bigger little problem is these little ripper nests. Then you only afford homeless. If you're not homeless, why do they call them ripper? Yeah, they'd be more harmful if they uh, were fully developed. And... Okay, there's still, still a little delay on the turning. Now, let's see. Obviously, up to the right, we have our health in the 
for sake of the big ass to be on gate of hearts. And beneath that we have our weapons, of which we can carry four. As well as three sub-items, which is you know, well, the, the upper three slots are four. Oh, oh hello. Oh, there was a nest I missed. Though we don't actually need to kill all of these, we can just pass through and... and what is it with you turning so slow, Bass? Or so... Not really slow, but that he doesn't want to turn as much as the mouse does, for some reason. I'll have to look into that. Yeah, I'll, I'll have that 1.5 patch installed by next time. That might fix that and some other th issues. I'd say they, they really put the slightly cartoony animation game used in this game. Uh, for anyone wondering what the hell that was that flew over our shoulder. Uh, yeah. What the? That's a big ripper. <laughs> oh! And these are the mature ones. And yeah, they do that. <laughs> they go on the ground and go all Bugs Bunny on your ass. If Bugs Bunny had like a mouth, a mouth that was only teeth. Luckily, they drop health. And somehow we've avoided getting hit so far. Yeah, they are, they look they are even simpler than that. Come on. One of them shot us in the back. Wait, we can get that for health. And it looks like this one is just stuck on the on the buildings. But we can just shoot it while it's in the ground as well. Which is not something you can do in most th games, I think. Uh, wait, wait, repeat that? Yeah, you, we can shoot it while it's in the ground. Oh, yeah, that's true. And, well... Some of it would not make sense to not have them to do that. But some of them should be possible to a degree. Like, if you shoot a rocket, do something that you can, is just making a bump in the earth, it should be able to hit it. I get the feeling I... Is this turning the, the sensitivity down? Okay, no, that. <laughs> now it was just completely not turning at all. Uh, no, not. This is probably a bad idea to put it on the highest possible. And uh, yeah, it's still only. Why the hell is it so. Why the hell do you just not want to turn sideways? You're not inverting the mouse. I, I make, I'm actually making big movements with the mouse now. I completely want hell. Okay, we're not even turning. We're not. The hell is going on with this? I'm sorry if the noise gets annoying. Did I somehow... Did I somehow hit a strafing button or something? That's zoom. What the hell? Oh, now you... Okay. Again, what the hell? Why are you being so stiff? Maybe... With some... Oh, of course, the white the blue suit on the computer is turned off for safety. But why are you? Come. Okay, this. The hell is going on with this? Mouse is at the absolute highest, and he still refuses to turn. Zoom or no. That's the front camera. 
is it not for is it not recognizing my mouse or something because it's too new or something? Okay, I'm just looking this up. Okay, for this, we'll add another ten minutes. What kind of mouse are you using? It's a uh, yeah, Logitech uh, MX Master 3. Is it one of those special gaming mouse or...? No, it's a normal It is not even a gaming mouse. Alright then. It should work for... I think it was around 2000 and they actually introduced... The, or even already introduced the mouse with a scroll wheel. Come on, my... <clears throat> of all the times for this stupid thing to loot, it's forget the password for some reason. <sighs> wait, wait. No, we're still live with this. It's not the Wi-Fi. What the hell's going on now? This one isn't even seeing the Wi-Fi. Run, connect, stupid thing. No, not save, connect. <sighs> GOG, Giant Sin Kabuto, Mouse, problem. Mouse acceleration problem. Need to limit the frame rate to 60. Okay. Yeah, okay. that explains. Yeah, we'll have to do a quick little quit here. And... Might as well turn that off for a moment. <sighs> One thing after another. But then again, we should be expecting these from very old games that are that old. Yeah, let's see. Frame rates. I think I glossed past that here. Okay, frame rate limit. Mouse speed fix. Okay, one big ass note for now is that if we're going with games that are older than 10 years, we go through the PC gaming wiki to get it to work, to do the the most prep, yeah, the most preparations that we can do. Yeah. So, yeah, this should be good enough to do that for games that are more than ten years old. Oh wait, I I could share it to you there, right? And or... that's, uh, that's what did you say? Uh, go on and share it. Uh, did I share it earlier there? Yeah, you share. You share. When it says uh, the stream has ended at the moment. Uh, let's see. Yes, start it up again. Okay, now it should be limited to 60 frames and hopefully not have that problem anymore. Share screen because I turned it back to windowed mode through uh, yeah, commands in the target for the shortcuts. Okay. And now we turn this back on. But yeah, I, I, sh I should change that from display capture to backup display, backup capture. Okay. Or maybe I should start with that as a basic one just to. Prefer try and prevent such bullshit in the future but uh yeah let's start the two hour count at this point now we've seen that now let's oh yep yeah. yeah yeah it is a lot more responsive so let's turn that down are you shitting me Let's 
Still the same problem. At least less so now. Does it need to be lowered to 60 frames or something? Or to 30 frames? Or is the command not working or something? Yeah, use frame rate limit. Dot, 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 dot. Where to put that in the same... Ugh. It's always nice when these things give incomplete uh, instructions, huh? Yeah. When, when I want some proper instruction, I want them to be proper. But also e easily explained. Yes, is it great? Was that something well, I that I noticed or overlooked there? Still here somewhat, but less. And now it's back to just not moving. <sighs> okay. Well, by now that stupid patch should have downloaded it anyways. Uh, with how fast my computer is, that should install in like two seconds. Hopefully that'll fix that. Yes. Run anyway. Yes. Yes, install. <sighs> Let's see. But, uh, command argument line. Okay, has been installed. Now, should this work finally, or should we call this a stream until this? Okay, that's new. Uh, it brought up a, a startup window instead this time with this new patch. Uh, let's see. Let's do further. Actually, let's update this. Okay. Uh, yeah, this, <laughs> this is a fan patch that, uh, despite this game being so old, there is still a small but still active community for this game. Uh, that I would. <clears throat> uh, the <clears throat> that do uh, regular multiplayer matches with this. And that is taking a bit of long, quite a bit of time for just five, 55 uh, gigabytes. Hmm. 55 gigabytes? Uh, not megabytes. Oh, okay. I got concerned over the, how big that patch was for that old kind of game. Yeah. Uh, I, I get the feeling this link will probably lead to that specific Discord. And yeah, I guess this might as well be the first video on which I'll try those uh, YouTube chapters to uh, yeah make, make things less painful for other for people to watch. Uh, for anyone not knowing, YouTube chapters is basically in the timeline at the bottom of the video that it uh, yeah it sections it off into parts that you can name and uh, I'll probably not call all of this this <laughs> the setup bullshit like <laughs> yeah. why <laughs> why is it taking this long for 55 megabytes <sighs> yeah half an hour in and still not even finished the first level Amazing entertainment. Yeah. Hmm. I think oh. it's sad that uh, it's, as you said, it's your favorite game of all time. So I feel a bit sad that it it's gives so much uh, trouble. But I've been eager to see you play it for a while. Well, yeah, a part of this is on myself for not properly testing it beforehand. Which, yeah, like I said, any game that's older than 10 years, we should <laughs> vigorously test beforehand uh, from now on. Yeah. At least it's finished in there in like a few seconds. 
at launch yes play okay digital mayhem i saw that that, that said digital extreme earlier or digital extremes the same people who work on warframe okay go live uh, okay that, not even to that okay open up exiting let's see one last thing to try and that is okay that is isn't full screen but okay that is showing at the top now maybe will this finally work with obs's game capture now game capture specific window giants wait giants main.exe No, it's not wanting to work. Okay, uh, nope. Uh, quick exit then, see if I can trick it. Options. Oh, borderless full screen. That should work. Yep, no secret box up at the bo top. And I should be able to share it now. Okay, so that 1.5 patch did just solve most of our problems. But let's see if it solves the biggest one. Okay, that has also reset the graphics to the lowest. Yes, it has. Okay, more as well. Water effects, I. Hey, yeah, this this is one of those games that just instantly applies all of these. Center on, bump mapping, bump mapping, environment mapping, view distance at max, resolution is good. And bump mapping. Okay, that, that has made Bass a bit chunkier than his, uh, sp his spindly bits earlier. And yeah, we can aim, we can look around. Finally. We can finally look around like we should without the mouse acceleration problems. Wonderful, and now I can. And yeah, we, I, if I recall correctly, we can shoot these things out of the sky with a bit of effort. Not enough effort on my part, at least, there. Okay, let's start. Welcome to Rusty Park. But yeah, we can start the timer for two hours now. These here are the baby rippers. Two shots of the pop gun. To kill it, they'll spawn infinitely from these little ripper nests. But we don't have to kill them, so we can just run past. We have our health on the right, in the elongated heart. Our weapons next to it, as well as our sub-weapons. Which will typically be grenades and flares and such. And on the far left, we have something that isn't filled in yet. But we'll get to that at the end of well, in the next level. Alright. Oh, and an idea. We can mm -hmm. cut up... We could, uh, for you to cut away the technical difficulties. Okay, but... I have, to, I have to say, I'm quite impressed with the, the modeling change that they did with Baz here. Yeah, they used to at least kept it uh, true to order, then, yes. Yeah. Here's the table, please. Yeah, his legs and arms are a bit bulkier. Yeah, it does look more like a podium, at least. Uh, yeah, those were normal or, and large rippers. Normal rippers, as you can see, they are very speedy. They can get on the ground and move around at lightning speed. Though they do get stuck for a moment once they pop back out. And large rippers are immobile most of the time. But they are attack... Well, the attacks of both the normal and the big rippers have an area of effect... Of, uh, yeah, an area of effect... Uh, well, <laughs> effect... <laughs> In, well, if, if they hit 
if those shots land near you, they'll still hurt you. Okay, one more. And yeah. Uh, oh, thanks, old man. Name's Buzz. Right, yo. Mine's Ahmed, but you can call me Timmy. There's no way I was giving my new jetpack to that old ripper. No, that's mine. Oh, you can have it, Mr. Basil, if you want. <laughs> and a lot of fun it was. Here now, carry me down this smarty mine shaft. The hatch is open now. Ah, all right. I'll show you how to use my jetpack. Gosh, you're a shot, Mr. Basil. Uh, Mr. Basil. <laughs> I'm trying to find a mate of mine. He's missing on. What the f is that? What? Oh, that! Wax models of hanging smarties. The sea reapers are trying to frighten us off Listen. our island so they can take over. What they don't oh, realize shit. is we've been here. Fuck me! What? The smarties! They're real! if you can rescue them. Please, hurry! <laughs> yeah, that's uh, quite something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now we have the jetpack. A question here. Did yeah? it something there? Hmm? What? It opened up in the hole. It feels a bit... something over here. Uh, yeah, that, this is, like I said, this is an old game. So there will be a bit, uh, well, gamey parts of it. This, the story isn't, well, the story is good. Uh, it certainly is funny, as you'll come to see. But, yeah, it's not really, like, realistic or fleshed out or lots. And, yeah, now we have our, let's see. The Wax Smarties say four Smarties using your sexy new jetpack. <laughs> Drop them off on the conveniently located Smarty Pad nearby. Watch out for hungry piranhas in the water. Right mouse button to use the jetpack. Yep, yeah, that's uh, what the left bar is. And now people shall know why I just crossed uh, here with any form of uh, machine that uh, can transport him in some manner. And yeah, we'll. All of these waters are piranha infested, so we just want, we want to stay out of them at all costs. And yeah, if you if you have enough forward momentum, the bass will do the Superman. <laughs> Though one minor complaint that could be have is that the jetpack meter can well blend in with the background. Uh, yeah, that that I can see is an issue. But uh, well, with how long I've played this game. It's almost instinctual uh, when you know how for, yeah, how much you have left. And yeah, we, d we don't have a time limit or anything with this. We just have to save four of them. And they will <laughs> infinitely respawn up there. But uh, let's not just uh, be a witness to uh, genocide. And uh, actually try to do something. And once that starts... They will be coming down. And once the sound stops, that's when they come down. And there we go. Lumphysburg, <laughs> tally ho. <laughs> uh, yeah, we can only carry one of these guys at a time. And for anyone curious about that over there, we'll see in a bit as well. And that one's a lost cause. There you are. 
Also, anyone who has uh, been watching cartoons for a bit, or maybe a specific cartoon recently from last year, you may have, or to you, uh, Timmy may have sounded a bit familiar. And actually, these uh, these smarty voices in general might sound a bit familiar. Yeah, it's Pinky from Pinky and the Brain. What? Uh, yep. <laughs> Yep, it's the very same voice actor that <laughs> that does the smart or a lot of the smarty voices. I don't actually remember their name specifically, but I do. well, it is Timmy. No, it is Pinky. <laughs> There's actually a lot of uh, quite a few known voice actors in this game, but they aren't actually credited for the most of the part. Or they are credited, but it doesn't say who voices who. So that is a massive pain in the ass. Yeah. Uh I don't think so, actually. Hello. Oh. This game, I'm. When what? Were... When were the Animaniacs made? Oh, well done, Mr. Basil. Here, take this present. It's a weapon that other spaceman dropped. What? You've seen another guy like me? Certainly, Mr. Baz. He's over there. He crashed in the big metal bird, and now he's dangling from a cliff. <laughs> what a joker! You can take this mine shaft to him if you want. Right, jump on my back. Brilliant! I'm gonna save him! <laughs> yep, that's what the smoke is. That's actually another fun thing with this game. A lot of the areas, or at least close ones, are visible from each other. Yep, that's where we just were. Nope. <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is our second weapon. It, well, it, it's a rocket launcher. <laughs> and as you could notice, uh, we can destroy the trees as well with this. And, well, the houses. And the furniture. Or some of the furniture. <laughs> yeah, a lot of stuff you can blow up in this. Some of the bigger things have gradual hard health or gradual damage models. So if you just keep firing at this house, it'll crumble more and more and more. Let's see, the rocks we can't destroy though. Uh, <laughs> yeah. These turn to thinner or to yeah firewood in a single shot from the weakest weapon we have and yeah we've got company on waiting on the other side uh, yeah as you can see the RPG deals a lot of damage but since it's a traveling projectile it can be hard to aim specifically at the traveling targets yes yes Denis, we know you're enjoying yourself Ammo pickup. That one <laughs> went over. Oh, hello. Uh, you're deciding to become active. Uh, yeah, like I said, <laughs> usually they stay <laughs> in their place. I don't know actually what triggers them to move at times. Maybe we got too close. And yeah, you also might have noticed that it got hurt from another paper shot. Yeah. They can kill each other. There's friendly fire among them. Yep. Specifically, they have showed it. I like that. Oh, we better hurry a bit because we are losing health. And with Timmy on our back, we are weighed down. Oh, thanks, Buzz. Thought I was done for it. My gun, took my oh, hello there. My name's. Oh. Oh. oh dear. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'll be over here if you need me. Easy, Tim. He's a friend. He's a friend. Come on, we need to find Reg. Oh, the Reapers will probably have him now, Mr. Baz. What? 
Oh, yes. Just yesterday, a Reaper squadron captured my whole village. I was only able to escape because of these old smarty mine shafts we've been traveling through. Well, where the bloody hell would they have taken it? Hmm. We could ask Daddy. He and Mother are the only smarties that didn't get taken. He'll know. They live high in the Codpiece Hills on Sorsha Island, but it isn't very easy to get there right now. Oh, great. Why? Well, for one, the entrance to that mine shaft is in one of the Reaper buildings, and that's guarded by Reaper snipers, who'll fire at the slightest movement. Then there are the Reaper guards, who'll swarm on you in a matter of seconds. And even before you get there, you have to take a mine shaft, which is in one of the Ripper's breeding grounds. Hmm, <laughs> not my idea of a good time. <laughs> but I'm willing if you are. You don't have any more firepower, do you? Mr. Basil, I'm ten years old for crying out loud. Besides, Daddy says I'm too ner nervous to play with guns, but there are smarty shops on each island. Just check your map. They'll give you more ammo, plus some even have new weapons. Right. Ready, Tell? Ready, Baz. Ready, Mr. Baz! And, yeah, <laughs> that's a quick summary of what we have to do for now. <laughs> uh, the Ripper nest, find the hatch that leads to the mineshaft, use the map to give orders to your mechs, because... Yeah, that's what these guys are called, the mechs, or rather the Macarians, which is a bastardization of mercenaries. On. Look at how this spells. Mm, yeah, mechs. This game started with evil double C. Yep. Oh, bloody heck. Let's see, left control, and then left click to attack, right click to go, and to, to return. Though, honestly, uh, yeah, all of these cutscenes are in-game, which is why <laughs> this was phasing through Basil's hip through game part of that. Oh, God. And now I hope that they can do this spell the word hip for some reason. Uh, no, I can leave that to you. Why would you only spell it? Okay, this place, as you can see, here comes the welcoming committee. And there goes the welcoming committee. <laughs> and yeah, Tell is our first companion. We will find more of our missing crew uh, later on. And yeah, they are armed with those double uh, double pop guns. And hello there. You're being a bit quiet again. I said, I don't know any game from 2000 where you think they run into bushes like that. Yeah, there's a lot that is special about this game, I'd say. Maybe, maybe some of these things were done better earlier, uh, better or earlier by others, but. Yeah, for me personally, this game is just a perfect little mix. And are you showing off, Tell? <laughs> I'm pretty sure he was doing flips. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the front camera again. No real reason why they have that in there. But yeah, Tell and any others will fire where we're firing. So, uh, yeah, imagine that with a full squad of five. Uh, again, we don't really have to fight here, and we can just skip on through. And, uh, yeah, there's, there's still a certain dread that creeps over me when I hear those things crawling in, burrowing in. Uh, wait to Sorcia Island, sneak past the sniper guard post, escape, escape through the hatch, leave the Sorcia Island. Uh, use the map if you need help. Watch out for the snipers shooting at your head as they can permanently impair memory functions. Yeah, a bit of the humor of this game is also starting to show, huh? And also just the music. <laughs> <laughs> the 
looks like it from a British humor. If I remember correctly, the composer for this game was none other than Jeremy Soul. Same oh. person who gave Guild Wars its music, among others. Oh, okay. Yeah, these are worms. These actually don't show up much, but they're basically early vermin. And that was me accidentally hitting two. And yeah. Let's see how Tell does on his own. <laughs> well enough. Uh, yeah, we do have to watch out with Tell though, as he can die. He can re he'll respawn a few times, but uh, a few times only. Um, is it per mission or per entire game? It's per map. Alright. So we have to be careful with our health now, because these the Sea Reapers are a lot more, are, well, generally tougher than the Rippers, because, well, they are, they are a lot more trigger happy. And we can already see how much Tell increases our firepower just with the pop guns. So, yeah, it isn't just the RPG that can hit enemies in the ground. If we line up our shots enough, we can actually get rid of us with the pop gun as well. Nope. I'm not sure. The, the game has called it the handgun for so, you know, so far, but I'm pretty sure that the manual calls it the pop gun. Yeah. <laughs> yes. All right. And here we have our first Sea Reaper man. Uh, yeah, we'll get, we'll have to get used to those shots flying by our head a lot. Oh. One of the Reapers have, has ticked off. Tell. Uh, give me that. Although, Reapers hiding behind the trees. <laughs> yep, the Reapers are taking cover. Um, okay, I don't, think, I don't think it's any game like this from the two parts about. Yeah, to have it in the cover. Well, only time that the cover would be in, well, uh, a cutscene, really. And yeah, here we have one of the smarty shops. Uh, of course, if we got to start and Timmy. <laughs> of course, it's going to be pretty uh, limited at, since we are at the start of the game. And it also has a health pool. We, we can go in these for healing as well, but uh, it's limited. And yeah, we picked up a health syringe for, well, the, what that does should be obvious. And then we have these mines. And if I remember correctly, if I remember correctly, it should be... Yeah, B. Okay, so that that way, and once it activates, it homes in. Let's take care of you first. Go after him. And yeah, as you can see, the, re the Reapers take quite a bit more damage than the Rippers. And I should be leading my shots better. I'm just shooting at the speed. And yeah, they're, they're tall, as you can see. Oh, and also that. Oh, hello. Yeah, this game also has a way of dealing with corpses. Yep. yep. We have another sniper. And there we go. Yeah, this game also has headshot uh, multipliers. Wait, do you just yep. sniper for him with a rocket launcher? Oh, it's not really a rocket launcher. We will get a... Well, it's an RPG, so it, it does fire rocket-propelled shells. But the actual rocket launcher... We'll get later on. Hey, you sniped someone with an RPG. <laughs> yeah. 
What the heck? Tail's showing off again. Hey. Hello, Father. Get yeah, in and do them dishes, son. My pleasure, sir. We're looking for a mate of ours. Look at me. I'm starving. Ever since those bloody sea reapers moved in, it's been too dangerous to hunt vimps on my own. Listen. Get me 20 pieces of fresh vimp meat and I'll help you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, Timmy's gone already. Vimps. <laughs> yep. Starving. Go hunt down some scrumptious but not too bright vimps. Return 20 pieces of vimp meat to Timmy's father for his dinner. And also during the loading screen it said the hunger in the cod piece mount hills, I think. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, yeah. this is a vista I'll never forget. Ah, that is a beautiful view. And I'm still stuck on the idea that you smite a sniper without a yield. I can hear you, bastards. Yeah, what do you think is going to happen? The sniper gets sniped, and I don't know the sniper weapon. Uh, one of them is trying to climb up. Uh, yeah, Ripper's mobility whilst on the ground is a lot faster, but they are just... They can't go a stra up straight walls like this. Okay, and that over there are the Vimps. Okay, Ripper incoming. And st <laughs> stuck. Okay, throw back that thing. I'll deal with the vimps. And yeah, these are basically like a sort of cow camels. And <laughs> okay. okay, let's grab it once. Yes. They look alien! How did you do that? Yeah. I hit myself a bit with that, I think. And yeah, we have 20 pieces. So now we just have to get back. Hmm. Okay, I remember something, but I'm guessing that's not going... That's just not uh, going to show just yet. And tell, come back here, you. Okay, we can use our chat pack to just help ourselves get up slopes a, a bit as well. It's not actually that powerful. But personally I think that adds to its charm because it, it ensures that you just can't you can't just fly from one end of the map to the other. It is good. And I respect that. Okay, here we are. Hey, you got me some food! You made ah, dinner at last! Wait, what's this? This food is raw! I never eat raw food! My wife cooks everything I eat! Oh my god, I forgot the wife! The Reaper Guards kidnapped her the other day! Right, look, I'm sorry about you, wife, but we're looking for someone that looks like us. Have you seen... Oh, I don't know. I, I, oh, I don't know. I can't think. I've got these hunger pains. My wife may have seen your maid. I don't know. Oh, oh please find me wife. Use this here holly bush. It'll keep you well hidden. I'm sure my wife can help you. Just bring her back now so she can cook me bloody dinner. What? Such a nice guy, huh? <laughs> uh, the wife rescued the smarty's wife the man starving <laughs> use the bush pack disguise to hide from river guards note that you can't fly or attack while wearing your bush disguise and that you can only wear it for limited spans of time it draws power from your jetpack 
Watch out for SAM turrets, which attacked airborne targets and hammer them with homing missiles. You can throw homing missiles off, uh, off your trail by using flares found in the shop. <laughs> okay, apparently the Rippers weren't fan of weren't a big fan of the guy as well. But uh, yeah, this isn't a new mission loading every time. This is uh, each of these chapters, or at least most of the time, it takes place in the same map, and uh, whatever happens in the previous moves on to the next. If you are in the same area, that is. As you can see, the wind herd is still decimated. What a win. And there Even should be something happening once all of these have been wiped out. If that is all of them. I have to say, it actually looked rather wimpy. Let's see. Yeah, you can even see the scorch marks from the other rocket uh, cells. Yep. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot about this. Yeah, you can play this in first person as well. And that over there, we'll see a lot. For now, though, I want to show off what happens when an entire vimper is eliminated. If I can hit it. <laughs> and yeah, they're smart enough to at least take a running. If you miss them. Is that the last? Because this game does have, have a feature that in, in case you run out of vimps. Okay, there must be another live one somewhere. But for now then... Oh, hello, I see you there. Get them. Get them. Okay, sniper. Oop. Tell, go Get grab them. him. In the meantime, I'll deal with the barracks. Yeah, these are the spawn points for the big reapers. Well, are you done there? And yeah, as you can see, they can spit out quite a few. And that is why you want to be mobile. Still have. What have you been attacking, Tel? The tower? The hell is he? Where the hell are you, Tel? Okay. Get away, you. Yeah, it is lucky that, the, that they dropped health and such, because this game doesn't have checkpoints. If you die, you start from the start. It's a mission. Oh. Grenades and flares. And we have a new mine. We have a new gun. Basically a faster handgun, but <laughs> faster handgun is still a better gun. Over there we have our first Sam site. Uh, another thing I have to say. I respect that they made the main character and none of the main characters are human. Uh, it's it is like it's an uncommon thing. In a yeah, the older ones. Yeah. Uh, just the 90s in general tend to be... Or the 90s and series tended to be a lot more creative with things. Yeah, but it was still a very human focus as he characters. Because I think people point to that... People thought to be more... Maybe not always had to be human to the main character. Maybe a hobbit or something. Which I kind of like, but they were definitely creative in all the ways in the 90s and 80s. <laughs> okay, oh, come on, Tell, now you got password. But uh, yeah, that, sh <laughs> that shows uh, well, the Sam sites, which can be very deadly and very trigger happy, as you can see there. And also, well, the companion respawning. But yeah, since these things are. Yeah, the moment I'm off the ground, it starts to lock on and which was the which button was the flares again 
That's gonna make sense, but it's meant to aim at anything that's airborne, so wait. I got an idea. Grab a ripper and toss it in the air. Wait. Yeah, that's the flares. I'm too used to. Uh, <clears throat> I'm too used to right mouse button being zoom in. Oh. I thought you were trying to use the flares to trick it to shoot itself for some reason. I don't think that's possible. Okay, now it's some debris. It'd be comfortable if it was. Uh, yeah, this is us using uh, <laughs> the push mode. We're still quite speedy whilst doing this. And it doesn't drain the power too much, uh, too fast. And luckily it also helps our allies. It also hides our allies. Okay. As you can see now, there's the crosshair isn't turning to the... Uh, well, the red isn't turning red. So that guy is out of our reach at the moment. So this guy, however, needs to get his head checked. You face like a yo, you sniping snipers with all the geek that like Wait well, it is a comedy comedy game but still Okay let's see No no this guy has figured this out Okay That over there that's a Reaper barracks well, we've seen what the Ripper Barracks does, so we want to get rid of this thing as well. And let's see if we can sneak around a bit with this. Actually, before we do... Heal up. Now, this, this game doesn't have a complex uh, style system or anything. Though the Reapers also aren't too well known for complex thinking. Well, they know enough how to take cover, at least. Yeah, <laughs> well, <laughs> those guys are going on an extended holiday, I'm guessing. Uh, but we uh, still have we more get, to deal with. Are we getting clear that these are at least more than an average mob from the 2000s? Yeah. We can't even switch our weapons, so... Found out. Okay, as if they have a line of sight on us when we try to hide, then they will see through it. Let's see, will this guy... There's, there's a funny little interaction with them if they are hostile and they get near you whilst you're hiding. <laughs> Come on, big boy. Uh, apparently not. Okay. Then your fate is sealed. Okay, smart ass. Good hearing on him at least. Not too smart on how to get around rocks though. Oh, hello there. Okay, th those charge shots, the, the big bright uh, Shots. Those are need to, those you need to watch out for, because they hit like a truck. That one. Okay. We have a jetpack, so we might as well make use of that and get a bit of an <clears throat> environmental advantage. You can clear all you want. <laughs> You're still going to die. Well, they did hurt the shoe, but I'm Oh, Okay, I see. Yep, you are still around. Uh, 
Come on, smart guy. <laughs> okay, I think that's all of them dead. And I'm guessing Tell is going on an extended vacation as well. And yeah, this is the map that they were talking about. It's not too useful, but at least it shows like the smarty maps and so the smarty <clears throat> shops and such. And I, I think this might actually be just uh, a top-down view of the, not just a, it isn't a separate map. This is, I think, just the the map was from above, with some of the object layers removed. And I saw tell on the map there. Hmm. Oh well. Empty. Actually... I have flares, so even if it blocks on... Oh, so th that sound is just a perfect scope. <laughs> oh shit noise, huh? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> nope. Ooh. Uh, yeah, of course, as a machine gun, this thing is hardly accurate at all. I'm not damaging on it per shot, but still, it'll deal with targets if you get close. Oh, me savior! Wait, she deserved it! Okay, <laughs> that was a bit of a different voice than I remember, but uh, yeah, the Max don't really like wife beaters, even if it is someone else's wife. Uh, the road home with someone's wife on your back. Return the lovely female smarty to her home in the mountains. Be careful, reinforcements are on you like stink on a monkey. <laughs> And new level, so our ammo has been refilled. But yeah, they sp as you could see, they spawned right outside here. Okay, tough guy. Okay, just show your head just to see. I can just take your arm off. Okay, <laughs> synchronized shuffling there for a moment. might actually die here if you're not careful. Well, with that, we do my position. Very fast, don't die. At least to keep you alive somehow. Okay, there we go. As with many games, enemies can drop random items like ammo or hand grenades in this case. Which we should probably. Oh, there you are. The same side still there. Hello. Goodbye. And there we have one of my favorite enemies, Sonak. Why is it one of my favorites? We'll get to see in a little bit once we take it off. So we should probably deal with the sniper on its back. Oh. He fires mortars, as you can as tell willingly demonstrated there. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm one hit away. Yep, yeah. yeah, there we go. <laughs> nice timing, Tell. I told you to not die, and I'm ready to go and grab a sandwich. Okay, starting off, open fire. Yep. 
Yeah, we don't have too much time to be <laughs> standing still, aiming up shots when there's this many nearby. Okay. And you also probably noticed there's no reloading in this. And it's only fire rate and how much ammo you have left. In some games I am fine with reloading, but some games reload uh, is very for the gun. Ah, there you are. See? Now let's go back to the Sonak and show off what it can do and one something in this game that I have I think I've only ever seen in one other game, which is also on the list to stream list. Oh, Where are you? There you are. Immediately they are going to cover. Okay, just stand still. <laughs> Take care of the mortar gun. Ah, there we go. Yep, it stomps the ground and causes an earthquake. What, what kind of shout? What the heck is that? Yeah, it, you could not see that because it was being blocked, but it's called a Sonak because it has a sonic attack as well. Oh. You need to wait for it to turn around if it can. Come on, big boy. Are you stuck? No, you're not. Okay. And. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't. I've only ever seen ground deformation like that uh, in one other game. And even then, it, it's different than that one. And we can only carry one of these health syringes at a time for balancing. But yeah, the Sonex aren't too tough. And well, since it's a big ass beast. It's going to need a big ass amount of these beasts. Oh god! Okay. The rest of the trip back should be relatively safe though. And we'll get to show off how the, the Reapers inter interact <laughs> with your stealth bush uh, in another mission. Because, well, they, they aren't the smartest, but they aren't complete idiots either. And yeah, shallow water like this, the, yeah, of course, that's not, re that's not piranha infested. But yeah, I, I, I don't know how difficult it would be but yeah the, the sonex stomp attack i don't think i've ever really seen something that truly compares to that in any other game like, there, there, are some, there are of course games that allow you to uh, distort the ground temporarily as well but not in rippling not in ripples like that in our games, but only in new games. No games that are old as this one, though. Yeah. I, I know that in sing Singularity, you can uh, deform the ground up and down uh, through some abilities. But that's only really the only other one I can th well, that I can think of, that, or that I know, that has ground distortion like that. I'm starving! Sorry, love, but we're looking for a mate of ours. 
Ah, oh, yes. I did see your friend. I was collecting potatoes for dinner when there he was. He picked me up and bathed me in the river. We spent the whole day together in the bush. That was when they came. Potency! They stripped me of my happiness and brought me before the evil Queen Sappho. This is the ugly little one we spoke of, Queen. Give her a thorough beating. No! His name was Reg. So manly. Beautiful. Me life well, will never be the same. Get that food on, love. That's Reg, all right. Oh, you must find Reggie. Old Grandpa Bourgeoisie has a boat that can get you to the prison where they took him. Timmy, be a good boy and take them. Timmy, where did he go? Oh, just hurry. Me feeling for Reggie can't be contained. Uh, come in, dear. Right. But as for you lot, stop idling about and clear High Village. It's been taken over again by Sappho's guards. Bloody hell. It's too high to reach. Besides, we gotta find this boy, Joycey bloke. Oi, tell your monkey to stop crying. That's what this is for. It's a nitro Timmy made for your jetpacks. Now get a bloody move on. The village won't clear itself. I'll make sure boy Joycey knows you're coming. Oi, you know something? You... Now get off my land before I set the dogs on you. Hungry! Yeah, again, he's something, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also, I do have gotta ask, when the hell did Timmy have time to make a freaking nitro? Good question. Does he think says he looks like he was kidnapped a moment ago? Yeah. High village, clear the clear the invested high village by destroying all the ripper husks. Make sure you use your nitro button to get up there. The husk will keep spitting out rippers until they're destroyed. But yeah, as I said, it, it's a game. They're they are playing the, the story mostly for fun, because yeah, for all we know, it's been it's the same day that we landed, where Reds that came from. Who the hell knows that? And yeah, <laughs> how could he have spent an entire day with her? Doing who God knows what in that bush. When tech, for all we know, we could have been here. We could have landed here this morning. Yeah, and of course, an entire day could just as well mean like a good amount of hours. <laughs> yeah, and, I, and look at the sky. Man. It looks like it looks like, look like about to the sun to set. Yeah. So this game doesn't actually. I'm trying to remember now. I don't think there is actually a night. I don't think that there you actually have to play during the nights in any of this. This is probably very good for. In some games, from the dark beginning an era, night missions was something that most people did not like. Yeah, that was still doing flips again. <laughs> now, this Nitro we activate with the space bar, which gives us a little kick in the ass with the jetpack. Anyway, right, it just gives a quick little burst and recharges on its own. If you're, in the, if you're in the air long enough, I don't put it clear on us. If you're in the air long enough, uh, you can use it the second time. And yeah, a bit of a disconnect between the story and the game. These aren't Sappho's guards, these are just rippers. Are you coming out? There we go. Uh, so this area cleared. 
Those look like smarty shops, but they're not. They're they're smarty pubs. They're just decoration. <laughs> Actually, if I remember correctly, I think you can hit stuff beyond the cursor range changing, so let's give that a little try, actually. Okay, <laughs> I don't think we can get enough distance for the cursor to return to normal. And yeah, the... The mission objectives are also called these things husks, but the game, you know, the first one calls them barracks. Not a little disconnect, but it's an old game. You shouldn't expect, like, perfect consistency and such. Yeah, I'm not too uh, or half stone, which was like five, I don't know, one. And one of the upgrades was for what they are Elven Archer, because they had the name wrong. I think it was a Wing Archer, because they upgrade called the Wing Rifleman. Okay, yeah, but with Blizzard, you'd expect them to double check a few things first. Oh, well, it was not this bad, it was uh, a Elf one. Yes. Yeah, he's hurt again. I thought you were talking about Hearthstone. No, no, not Hearthstone. No, 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 no. Okay, one more. And there it is, hidden. I think you can... What I was talking about earlier, or wanting to talk about it, I think you can hit things outside of the, the uh, cursor range changing. But it takes a bit of aiming, of course. And yeah, with the last of the barracks gone, <laughs> we immediately go into the next one. Grandpa Bourgeoisy. Find old Grandpa Bourgeoisy and see if he can help you get to the uh, prison where they took Reg. And yeah, we're going through this quite fast, but it, these missions on their own are quite short. Which is kind of needed when if you die, you start at the beginning again. Things will get longer, of course. Uh, yeah, I, I just I just know this game almost like the back of my hand. Oh dear, that's not good. And yeah, he's over on the edge here, near the at the beach. Let let me let, let me put this to rest. What's at the back of your hand at the moment? Skin. They have a million of rolling for me someday. And yeah, as you can see, the minigun is great at dealing with rippers since they have that. Uh, they can't fire back that soon. How many screens do you think this would take? Uh, there are three campaigns to deal with, as could be gleaned from the options that we took so many looks at. Oh. Um, yeah, I'm not actually going to take a guess. Maybe, well, hmm. I, I say that uh, almost immediately I go for a guess. But we'll have to see. <laughs> yes. uh, again. Damn it! Have you seen Timmy? He was supposed to be here. I knew that boy's gone and got himself kidnapped again. No idea. Listen, we need to get to the Reaper prison. One of our mates is... I. That prison is where I'll be taking me poor grandson. Ah, uh, yeah, Mr. Bourgeois, we need a raft. And... Damn it. I've got the raft. But I'm gonna need help. It... Your lads mind helping me rescue Timmy? For I'm just an old man, plus me balls are saggy. Yeah, sure. We'll help. Good. Then we'll need plenty of these. Bears, looks like some of our grenades. Fresh, exploding taters. I've been growing them since yesterday. What a liar! Damn it! Nah, again! Oh, come on! To the raft! Timmy's in danger! 
Oh, Craig. We're done for. Don't cross me, son. I built this with my own hands. And there's no better raft in all the land. No, oh, that's not Timmy. He'll be prettier than that. Come on, Baz. Let's take him. Yeah. <laughs> Meet poor Joycey. Also, in that little explosion, his house was supposed to be destroyed. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, this game is a bit... This game does have its flaws. I will readily admit that. Uh, but since it's a perfect comedy game, you know, comedy style, you can't forgive them for some. Yeah. Okay, Rags' Dilemma. Kill the Sonak to rescue Rags. It's not like this is the first time you've had to detach Rags from some hairy beast. <laughs> The Sonic has a sonic attack that can temporarily disable your jetpack, but it's got a great beat that you can dance to. Grenades are a great way to say hello, gun-toting stranger. And yeah, I think from what I saw and remember of this chapter, it's called... Um, actually, I've completely... Uh, the prison is called Dick Witten Prison, I think, but I forget what the prefix on the chapter is. Like escape from or something. Yeah, we'll have to see when it pops if it pops up again. Because we're been live for an hour and a half now and we've been spotted. But we did have like a half hour of technical difficulties. Sneaky little yep. bastard, leaning her head aside. Oh, up. On us. Yeah, one little issue that I could name is that the AI partners in this don't open fire if they're near enemies, only if they well, get hit or if you shoot at them. Um, well, even at, when you're shooting at them, they're more shooting at where you're shooting. At. But that can be good, but it means they not not necessarily angry enemy. Okay, new back item. The shield. I've seen some games where you try to be stealthy and your ally aggroes everything. Yep, though, well, as we saw, this isn't really a stealth game. Yeah. Except for the bushes. That's. Probably what's going on is deluxeness I've seen so far. Yeah, and it's more like it breaks. No, it doesn't break the aggro, but it prevents you from getting aggroed by enemies. And yeah, this shield, well, it, it does what a shield always does. It does drain your jetpack power quite a bit, though. Wait, that was a shield? Yeah. The graphic is a bit off because it seems to be behind Bass. But it's in Good front. Good morning, your friends have transmit the signal. <laughs> I'm guessing the uh, I'm guessing the signal is we come in peace, don't shoot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're coming this way. For this one we only have to kill the Sonak. Next, get back to Borjoisi. Borjoisi awaits. Return to Borjoisi and thank him for his help. Try to at least sound sincere. He's an old smarty with testicular difficulties after all. Wait, what? Uh. Okay, here's the weird thing. The pink game has been very clean so far, but it gets pixelated very often during the fixed uh, moment. Okay. So but I'm guessing Discord hasn't fixed those problems after all. I think they have, but as I said, 
it has been clean for the most part. It also gets a bit odd for the most time that it takes to up. So, just to go ahead and I think they need to stick. Audio mixing is going better in this as well. Oh. <laughs> Baby rippers. Oh, no. right, yeah, all we need to do is run back here. Ah, <laughs> Reggie, I hear you're quite the man about two. <laughs> oh, you know. Trying to give myself a little taste now and then. Ah, what's he done? You dirty wee bastard. If it weren't for you, Timmy would be fine now. So you better damn well get him back. Now, while you were gallivanting around saving this pathetic swine, Sappho's guard set up three new barracks. Here, take this sniper gun. Now go out and cap him right between the eyes. Yeah, <laughs> we have a sniper. So now you can snipe the snipers properly. Yep. The Reaper Guard Barracks. Destroy all three Reaper Guard Barracks and all the guards. The guards will keep coming out of the barracks until the buildings are destroyed. Your sniper rifle works great from a distance. Zoom in for easier aiming. And all the nearby Reapers have been deloaded. And really tell. What? <laughs> Walking backwards. But yeah, now we have two of these jackasses. Oh, and ain't that cute. It's also dead. Oh dear. But yeah, now we have about triple the firepower that we started with. And yeah, they have infinite ammo as well. Uh, let's give this shield another shot just to see if I can get them to interact with us. Uh, yeah, we've got quite a bit to do here still. Uh, not too much actually. There's a bunch of them here, so we... S I actually don't want to slide down, I think. <laughs> I think we should rather just... Go. <laughs> yeah, they'll come look at you. And of course they run back, because they're idiots. <laughs> their IQ is in the same amount of digits as their eyes. Oh, what? Hold on. Hey, there's some, some powerful gun if you can block up a building. Yeah. Okay, the next one is over there. I think our shots... I think their shots actually travel longer than ours. So as you can see here, we are... We should be hitting the barracks with their shots. Or maybe not after all now. Yeah, it, it can be a bit difficult to aim them at long ranges. Okay. Heal up. Okay, now there's <laughs> now we've got their attention. Relocating. Get back over here, you dumbasses. One of them is fighting in there. And of course it's Reg. <laughs> okay, there should be other points in here that we can answer through. And now you're complaining that you've fallen behind. Uh. Yeah, sadly the 
personality of the max, what little they do have, doesn't actually come up that often once they've joined. Aww. Uh, yeah, personally, I would have loved to have seen a sequel of this game, an action, a true sequel where you maybe you get a bit more interact, get more yeah, a bit more out of these idiots. And uh, yes, yeah, so we've gone almost entirely around the freaking uh, islands. Uh, is the company still around? Uh, I think they are, but they've been bought out and they've only been really making the crappy Wii games and such. More. I'm, actually, I don't. Last time I saw them on Wikipedia, I think they only had like Wii games as their latest thing. And I think Red just got himself killed. Did I still in the main Wii game? I I think yeah, that makes me think that why they may have gone out of business. And Res died. Out of that. Oop. Almost dying myself. <laughs> if that had landed, I would have been dead. Okay, time to heal up. And we might as well take the shield with us. Luckily, I don't think they ever run out of these syringes. Uh, yeah, as you can hear, it's like a freaking hornet's nest in there. Have you ever heard a hornet's nest? No, luckily. <laughs> but uh, well, it's more than obvious that they are freaking pissed in there. I go the nope. <laughs> okay. The <laughs> cell just got blasted in mid mid air. Ow. Oh, hello, you were smart enough to find your way out. Not smart enough to watch your back though. <laughs> okay, got that. And then we immediately grab a new one. Uh, yeah, they they all once they have spotted you, they do tend to just always know where you are, no matter where you go, or what's in between. And dead. <laughs> yeah. As you can see, ah. <laughs> this game can get quite difficult. Not Dark Souls difficult or anything, but still, uh, that you have to be very careful. Okay, that was just Tell flying at us. I think there is a spot where we can get a better angle on this place. Okay, we can fly up there and then there. And we should have a better sight of everything. For now... So we need to destroy these as fast as possible before they get too many out. For us, send the herd as fast as we can. Send those two off to do some dirty work. We can take shots at this one. And yeah, of course, the sniper rifle doesn't do that much damage to buildings. But still, yeah, a good amount at least. Okay, go after that one. Healing. Yeah, if we die. Uh, yeah, mission reset. Doesn't matter. The others can't revive us or anything. Uh, 
Might as well use the shield. Uh, okay, just lighting all up, huh? Okay, go, go, go. So can I say that I just love that sliding animation if you're going down a, a slope? Might as well fill up. Uh, yeah, now we have to clear the place out. We've seen them throw grenades before, but yeah, there we start again. Yeah, th these Reapers are pretty damn dangerous. And we've seen how fast they can spawn from those barracks. Yeah, they still seem to have a, a weaponry that has quite a punch. Okay. Shields. I think normally I just cheese this this mission by taking pot shots wherever I could. Present for you. Is that the last? No, nope, that's you guys. Go grab him. There we go. I'll deal with Mr. Horman. Yep, easy as that. <laughs> we are busy doing that. They send in more guards yet again. The Sonak patrols <laughs> kill the three Sonak patrols. Sonak Reaper guards. Everything must go. It's a blowout sale of evil. Wait, what? Quick before he starts. Do you just blow out sail on? On evil, or rather of evil. It, just, 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 just something beautiful. Just beautiful about that rippling effect. So we have to be a bit careful with this. Oh, the other patrol is nearby. If we, we if we kill the Sonak without killing the <clears throat> the uh, the mortar uh, handler, it they can get underneath the floor and nice. be unkillable, basically. Oh, time to retreat. That's not my overpower. Get back here, you two. Did that just move a bit? Whoa. Okay, we can deal with the Sonax. Yeah, that's a bit useless there, big boy. We can deal with the guards when they spread out a bit. Oh. I say it, I almost get killed again. <laughs> Uh, yeah, another just minor, yeah, minor gripe is that I would have liked to see a bit more variation in the Macarians' appearances to uh, make them make it more identifiable. Because this is literally the same model cop copy pasted. Someone's being a bit gun ho And yeah, they're, 
Their accuracy isn't perfect, so if you stand still, there's a good chance that they'll miss you, of course. But that also means that if you're moving, they might get an act they might get a hit on you anyways. Okay, fully healed. Okay, two stragglers there that we can deal with. Let's see, where are you? Wait. Uh, come on, don't I'm pretty sure that we blew up we blew the the gunner's head off, so it that can't possibly Okay, maybe Maybe a bit half glitched. We'll have to see if we have to redo this or not. For now though, there is the last patrol on the other side of the hill here. I'm confused. If you lost it in his head off, then there should be a head remaining at all. Right down here. Make it rain. Okay. Uh, let's see. One straggler. Yep, yes, there you are. <laughs> the heck was one of them doing? Yourselves. But listen, if you want to learn the ways of the smarty, we don't. Start with this. Ooh. I said we don't, you old tell can it? This could come in handy. Good. Now we're ready for the guard bunker. The what? Across the drawbridge. Now, keep your heads down. There are a lot of snipers in these hills. Once inside their base, you should quickly take out the catapults. That's how they send in reinforcements. Come on, lads. We hardly get any action these days. Here. Yeah. I thought we were going to Planet Majorca. <laughs> yep, here's the rocket launcher. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to know where Jersey pulls these from. Yeah, and I think... I have to say... During the thousands and before, everyone was going to Mallorca. Maybe everyone. I I, well, yeah, at some point I did learn that it is there's an actual place called Mallorca, but I thought that this game and Armed and Dangerous were the only two that made a mention to Mallorca. But I'm I'm guessing I've been missing out on a lot of mentions. Yeah. I think it was rarely mentioned in games, probably. But you probably have met many people who always had to brag of being there. Okay. I've, I've actually I've... been there once. Okay. I, th I think I only heard of it like in the last five years or so. <laughs> You're missing out. And actually, I saw a very unique weapon there, which I did not buy suddenly enough. And it was, that was. A gun axe. <laughs> An okay. actual old gun axe. But no, the gun blades were sold out. No idea, but I don't know. Gun axes was more common and actually actively used in military service. Okay, that's a new one. Especially by the Polish. But yeah, gun blades. That was a <laughs> there was a reference to Final Fantasy. <laughs> I forget which one, but they have these ridiculous blades, which some for some reason have a revolver uh, cylinder worked into them, and it, they ne they're never used, as far as I know. <laughs> they, they exist actually too, but yeah, they were more extremely rarely used, for they were not uh, very good weapons. I'll send you a picture of the Final Fantasy gun blades after this. But for now, we have to deal with the log launchers. 
Finally, oh, yeah. destroy all three guard launchers. Look out for horn wielding Reaper guards. Once they sound an alert, guard reinforcements will be on their way. Watch the skies. Use your rocket launcher to clear groups of enemies with just one shot. Okay, but before that we have to figure out... Actually, we don't have to figure that out. We can look it up. Let's see. There should be this card weapon somewhere here. Special activate house party party house item that's later on. Yeah, I will not forget. I know what the gunblade is. I have seen Shadow versus these videos about them. Uh, oh dear. Yeah, we'll we'll be dealing with guards mostly, so I think the machine gun may be less useful for this. Okay. I think I've noticed that thing before, but it doesn't actually serve a purpose or anything. I think it's just an asset that they've moved aside. Uh, yes, those are the guard bunkers. And the there's guard. The first little pesky horn guard. Oh. Yeah, yeah, snipers. We'll have to be careful of those. Okay, that's just a chimney. Ah, there you are. Okay. Yeah, these guard bunkers, re when <clears throat> if uh, alerted, Reaper guards will come charging for these and take cover inside of them. The, it'll drop. It'll uh, drop down on them. Ah. Here we have a perfect little thing. Something opened fire there early, and okay, that <laughs> that only injured a bunch of them. Yeah. I probably only hit the wall be behind them, so that wasn't a kill shot. Uh, that's what you did. Exit throw it, hit the wall. Okay, there's another shop over here, <laughs> but also a, a hornman. Also, well, these towers we can also destroy, as you can see. Uh, let's swap out the flares, because there's no. I don't think there's SAM sites over here. And yeah, the reason that I went here is that there's a bit of a, a sneak path. You just have to deal with some burns or burns. Because from here, we can take out a guard through the lens flare and get a line of sight on the the log launches, which is basically yeah. It is just a freaking cat catapult. Or ballista might be uh, more accurate. Yeah. <laughs> yes, their shots are reaching. That should be... Okay, it's only damaged. And yeah, there's some very angry reapers down there, but we can continue on to over here. But yeah, since we killed the horn guards quick enough, we did, they didn't actually get alerted, or they couldn't get the alert off. But basically, <laughs> when those reinforcements come in, there will be a log flying overhead, and they'll just parachute off of that. Oh dear. And that actually... Yeah, I think that reminds me of, me of one Star Trek episode, I don't know which one or something else. The one that they did, what they call a helmet catapult. We were basically just a machine that took, that basically turned asteroids into it and just launched an asteroid against planets. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. She's now terrifying. Are they heading for the bunker or not? That one is. 
greedy little jackass, refusing access to his friends. Get rid of the log, get rid of the platform, get rid of you. And almost died. <laughs> out and he peeked into death. So many things to deal with. Come back here, you two. Dick Whittington lift, get to the lift and ride it through the gift shop. <laughs> yeah, it's just, just another get to the next mission bit. And yeah, as you can see, we have rocket enemies now. Yeah, I can see that very clearly. Most in the room, but they are standing at that. Yeah, of course, they deal a lot of damage. Smart enough to keep mobile most of the time. And let's point that away before we blow ourselves up. That's probably the smartest thing I heard you say in a damn long time. Also, this will show up. Our allies, uh, yeah, they have unlimited flight. <laughs> I think that made this one slow for comical reasons. Nice teamwork, lads. Here, look at this. I've created a new bomb which will destroy the doors to the prison where they shall be holding to me. Come on, give me a hand, Reg. It's called a pop-up bomb, and I've made it extra light so you'll be able to move around easily with it attached to your back. Come on, lads! There it is. Dick Whittington Prison. Those doors are the strongest of their kind. Listen, my boys. If you set off the pop-up bomb right by those doors, you'll be able to get inside and free Timmy. And believe me, Timmy's spying ability will come in handy when you go up against the Sea Reaper space. Oh, no, no, wait, wait, hang on, hang on. No one said anything about fighting Sea Reapers. Fred is right. Weapons are one thing, but spells and magic... No way! Yeah. Besides, we're supposed to be a planet Majorca right ah, now. Ah, shut it! Come on! Where's your spirit, lads? I mean, bloody hell, all we'd be doing at planet Majorca right now is lying in the sun, sipping G&Ts and talking to the Majorcan ladies. Well, Timmy is a strong lad. He should probably learn to look after himself. Hey, maybe I could come along on your trip. What you say, Reg? Is it far from here? <laughs> Look, we've got a job to do. Majorca can wait. Bye. Yes, yes, of course. Uh, Tim is in danger. Go on. Take out the doors to the prison. <laughs> yeah, telling the reds just they just want to get the hell out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Dick Whittington Prison. Destroy the prison gates using the pop-up bomb. Only the pop-up bomb can destroy the gates. Check the shop for an extra pop-up gum if you need one. 
and uh, yeah, extra lights. <laughs> right. How heavy is supposed to be? Heavy enough to significantly. Well, we can't even get off the ground with it. <laughs> you can't get off with the boost though. But yeah, it significantly slows you down. So back to the bush. And yeah, all we really have to do is get that thing over there. Hold on a second. I think I just remember something about these things. I think they'll actually start breeding if you leave them alone for too long. Like they'll lay an egg from which a new one will spawn. Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. But yeah, the only thing we really have to do is, is get close to the door, put down the bomb, and get the hell out. But there's those to be a problem. Turrets. Oh. Turrets that are going after one of ours. Get back here, you. And yeah, there's also... Just some patrols going around the place. And there's another, and I'm out of sniper ammo. But yeah, if we shoot at some. Did that actually damage? It's not changing the health bar. Okay. Coming in to help you, dumbasses. As we like, it's in the end now. what is? The time is freaking ten. Oh yeah, ten p.m. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we have about half an hour to go then. Oh, hmm? I forgot uh, how heavily delayed we were. Yeah. See? What was that? Oh, there was just one of them. <laughs> I, I do like telling rides for as little uh, personality as they do show. That just makes it more annoying that I can't sell them apart. Where the hell did you come from? I don't think he came from behind. Does that help? And yeah, the, those turrets fired their charge blast at standards. Okay, give me that, give me that. Okay, no need for first person mode. I don't think these things actually have any real extra animations for first person mode. But we have to deal with those turrets. Sniper rifle. Okay, now you two. Out of ammo. But even if we're out of ammo, then our allies will still keep shooting. And I think that's most of them dealt with. Certainly has quite up the place. Okay. That's right. Also, I have to say that the, the bush the backpack, uh, it looks more like a turtle. Uh, maybe. I thought it was a bug a few times. The Diaries of Samuel Pepys? Pepys. Not anyone I'd know of. 
That's probably a joke. Yeah. And yeah. I suspect that might be one of the most British people in the world, so I do not think that's that name at all. Okay. Just gotta plant this thing down and get the hell out. Run. I think I'll fly. We <laughs> Was a bit more powerful than expected. Come on, let's look for survivors. Ha! Good day, mate. Crikey, I, I can't believe I've finally been rescued. Here, let me join you, fellas. Wait a sec. Don't go. You're welcome. Uh, we're looking for Timmy, man. Have you seen him? Ah, oh, yes, yes, Timmy. Uh, he was my cellmate before they moved him. A real sport he was. Taught me how to sing. <laughs> Not much else to do held up in a prison cell all day and night. Right, where is he now? Yes, sir. Taught me to sing so many great songs. Smarty, me and unite. Drink the barrel dry. The old... G don't test the slab, or you'll be feeling the end of me stick. Yes. Was that another one? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, there were so many. Ow! What are you doing so to me? Ah, I must have moved him to the torture tower. I feared as much. Yes. Yes, that's where they took my singing partner. Be a sport and bring him back. He sang like an angel. Here, here, this should help. It's called a Millennium Gun. <laughs> Big fella, isn't it? Crikey! It's never done that before. Stuff, oh, bastard. Here, Baz! <coughs> You'd better handle this one. We'll need it if we're going to get to the torture tower. All right, wait a minute. Bloody hell! Look at the size of this thing! Come on, lads, we've got to try this one out! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, the fortress! That's where Sappho has him, lads! You in? Uh, look, Baz, the guy's clearly bonkers. Let's do a runner and get Gordon and Bennett to pick us up. What'd you say? Find him a joke in a week. He helped us find Ranch. Can't let the old geezer down. Yeah, Badge is right, too. I mean, the least we can do is get his grandson back. All right, Bourgeoisie. We're in. Let's go. Yeah! And there's more where that came from. Now go and knock out the gate to Torture Square before I die of old age. Okay. Ready, lads? And be careful, laddie. This time you're going up against Sea Reapers. Incredibly fast they are, and their spells are deadly. Now go on. I'll be sitting under this tree. Right. Bet you will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I think... I think it tells a lot of like how much I'm smiling despite the troubles that this game gave. Though technically it was more... Uh, yeah, the mouse thing was this game, but the rest of it not wanting to record, that was mostly OBS. Uh. <laughs> I just never got to work. Okay, this level will be a bit trickier though, because like you said, we'll be going up against Sea Reaper Mages. Yeah, it's also it's also a bit of a disconnect between the, the game what the game's telling us and what the game's showing us. Uh well you could say that the Sea Reaper race is split between the guards and the well the non guards. Uh yeah, we'll be fine we'll there you... Luckily, the Sea Reaper Mages, as I'll call them, or Sorceresses would be more likely, it would be more accurate. They are deadly. Okay. Oh. Torture Square. Destroy the Torture Square gate with a pop up bomb. Only the pop up bomb can be destroyed this gate. Need a... da -da -da. Try out your Millennium Gun on a bridge or pack of enemies. In this case, size really does matter. <laughs> Watch out for evil rakes who can use spells to kick your ass. And the rakes are the, uh, well, the Sea Reaper Sorceresses. 
And yeah, we, we can throw away our handgun, pop gun. I still don't know which, which it's... No, the game says the yeah, handgun, but I've, I've heard it be called the pop gun for like forever. And yeah, we're dealing with Sam Sturridge again. I kind of wonder if they have a rough development time on this. Wait, you want to explain a few things? Let's see. Let's get, a, let's get rid of the one big gun for another and keep the sniper. And yeah, this is basically a handheld mortar. Fireworks? No, those are miniature warheads it's firing. Oh. No, yeah, no more whippers aren't a problem anymore with our backup. Oh. Turrets, however, might still be an annoyance. So those things are pretty tough. I oh, but, oh. <laughs> okay, I just thought it. Was, and yeah, they try to, they try to lead their shots. <laughs> Gun, I mean? It seems like one of those... You get the weapon at the end of the game. But we're only in first chapter, are we? Uh, we are in the chapter... We're in chapter 4 of the first campaign. The, uh, no, the search for Timmy. And yeah, this thing here, this is our paragon. We can use it to heal our allies. Or ourselves, I think. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's deal with this Sam turret. And actually, some barracks as well. Reg, you idiot! Oh, that, that was Reg. I might as well show this. There we go. Yeah, we'll see more use of the yeah of the repair gun later on as well. For now though, we have a hornet's nest to disturb here and a turret to deal with. Okay. There we go. It's a little flaw or a little expo you could call that their shots travel farther than ours, but it works. And yeah, the game is pretty tough. Yeah, otherwise. They can go allow you to see the out or not only see the thing, but allow you to go and manage that. Yeah, and it's ne it's never been patched out. So you, you could consider it a feature. Oh, another Sam site. I don't know if there's a limit to how many enemies can come out of a barracks at once. But let, I think we'd rather not find out, huh? Yeah. And that was Tell getting blown up. Leave my shots with these guys. Actually. <laughs> we can just mortar them to hell and back. Because yeah, we have to, we have to shop here, we can get infinite ammo back. Heal. 
that, that sound, that, that sound just make your hair stand on edge. Where the heck was that coming from? I think there's only one turret left that's up there and it shouldn't have a line of sight on us. And it seems that Tell... <laughs> okay, the boys are dying quite a bit. I probably should have kept the machine gun to deal with the, the guards. Sneak our way up here. And I think one of them isn't coming back already. Oh, oh, there I uh, I've forgotten about you. Alright, that should make things clear. Let's see. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, there we can see the old battle sack. Okay, fill up, get rid of those. Um, yeah, machine gun. Let's get glance of them there. There they are. Those are the rakes or the, the, well, the sea reapers. The sea reaper sorceresses. Either way, they're bad news. Also, this guy has some bad news coming his way. He needs to go see a doctor about his eye problems. <laughs> I think Okay, I hope everything isn't getting too drowned out by gunfire and such. When I look at OBS, I see that the sounds of the game and us are on about equal level. I think that might have been the first one when the Ripper got a bite on me. And I think we're going solo now. It's only okay. Only those snipers and the sorceresses. So let's introduce ourselves with a bang, don't we? Don't we? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bit, of a, <laughs> Bit of a lip dick introduction. Wait, what? I thought somehow you did something before. Okay, the other one hasn't been triggered yet. Okay, just gotta be careful. Wait. Or they can just be dumb. <laughs> it okay. was attempting a spell. What is space organ? We have a lot of space gorgons. Oh, they can't What's turn that? you to stone, I'm pretty sure that. But they, but they can do that. <laughs> uh, yeah, we got kind of lucky there. 
Because they have quite a few more spells at their disposal, I think. Either way, though. Better to put the Millennium Mortar away for now. Um, yeah, we might have to call it after this. Yeah, it is getting later. It, and I uh, am surprised that it was sleepy already. I don't think it's a hard to close the window. Whoa. But wait. Did you just get called to science? Ooh. Sappho's daughter. She's different from the rest of the rapers. Doesn't believe what her people are doing to the Smarties. Ah! You can't kill him. He's just a child. He was caught spying. No, I won't let you. Ah, lovely. Cheers, mate. So, uh, what's going on here then? Oh, it's the monthly sacrifice to Caputo. <laughs> Sounds painful. So, who's the unlucky blinder? Some kid called Timmy. <laughs> Simi, you say? Oh. oh, listen, mate. Do us a favor. Oh, listen, mama, will you? Oh, yeah. Timmy! 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 Our size? But nay, it's impossible. It doesn't exist. That's Kabuto. <laughs> Did we just get eaten? Yep. Yeah, the, the audio is a bit off on that. It's late. But uh, yeah. <laughs> 
Uh, <clears throat> we are... I, I think this is the third last level of this mech campaign, actually. So we almost got through the entire Mecharian campaign in uh, this uh, rather troublesome uh, stream. <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah that's the cinematic where i got the uh the footage for my intro and outro from and uh, yes people i'm the one with the picking the basket yep <laughs> uh, i'm half tempted to put the intro over that uh, either way though this has gone on for long enough for now We'll be able to restart from right here. So, right. yeah. With the menu and current mission. And, yeah. Then we can start from here. And it was. Okay, so it was just Dig Whittington Prison that the chapter was called. Uh, okay. So, yeah, despite my. My frustration with this was more because, yeah, it was blocking me from playing one of my favorite games. But as always, let's have a little look at who may or may not have been watching this. If this Twitch app wants to work. We are still recording, we are still live, so there should be no problem in showing me my own stream. Come on. Also, of course, if I'm n if I don't mention your name and you aren't in chat, it's because the app isn't showing you as in chat. And otherwise, if I don't mention your name, it may be because I suspect you of being a bot. So let's have a little look. Rogue girl, thank you for watching. Stay rogue, stay girly. And yeah, that's about it. It seems from what. It okay, so I did see that. It's the logo jumps forwards. And as always, of course, special thanks to you, Rakir. Oh, you're most welcome. And, uh, yeah, what do you think of this game? It's hilarious. Uh, and the, the semi-sequel... Well, not really... Se There's another game by Planet Moon Studios called Armed and Dangerous. I've mentioned it a few times now. Uh, it is sort of seen as a spiritual successor to this, though it doesn't have some of the features... Uh, but, but it's still freaking hilarious. Probably more so than this game, even. Okay. But, uh, yeah, next time we'll finish the Macarians uh, campaign. We'll get started on the second campaign. And if I want to do a guess right now, I'm thinking maybe four or five streams. This, is, this game isn't too long, but it doesn't have to be too long. It, it's... It isn't meant to uh, keep you hooked and suck you dry of money like many more normal, yeah, modern games are now. This game was made simply to entertain, and they, they did that for certain. <laughs> what the heck they did, sure. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I think I think with this, I will finally put something in the description when I upload these to YouTube. I will put a dis. I will see if I can put a Discord link up for that uh, giant Susan Kabuto community Discord, because there are still almost weekly multiplayer games of this going on. Personally, I haven't been able to join one yet, but I'll certainly try to, and maybe, maybe even I'll, I'll see about if I, I, I'll see about maybe getting permission to record those if I do get in. Oh dear. I'll, I'll have to ask permission of the other players, of course. But I've actually never played this game in multiplayer before, so that should be a fun time. Probably getting my ass kicked all of the time, but still. <laughs> well, it definitely be a new experience for you then. Uh, yeah. Anyways, let's see if the shortcuts from OBS will work this time. Because for some reason they seem to be getting blocked by uh, the game. Though maybe the patch might have fi fixed that. Either way, though, thank you everyone again for watching, and well, next time more giants in Kabuto. But until then, until then, be safe, folks. And the buttons aren't responding. So yeah, it, <laughs> there's just something with the game that's blocking the shortcuts from happening. 
So uh, see ya.